Namaste children. Welcome back to this series for children. So I hope all of you had uh, have been meditating on this small meditation which I provided last time, the first meditation for all of you. So today let us go a little bit further. And I also hope that all of you have been waking up in the morning by saying that small short prayer I told you, like Opening your hands and seeing Karagre Vasade Lakshmi, Karamathe Saraswati, Karamule to Govinda Prabhate Karadarshanam, and then getting up in the morning. Now, uh, let us go a little bit uh, forward. Um, so, let's see about sun. What is so great about the sun? We are living in the solar system. Okay, you can see there the sun, and there are so many planets around that which is uh, going around by themselves and also revolving around the sun. The earth is revolving around the sun while rotating on its own axis. So it is getting all the warmth from the sun. So we have to always remember we live in the solar system. Sun is very, very important for us. It's our life source. It's an incessant flow of essential love energy. It enlightens our consciousness, revealing that we are part of the supreme consciousness. Okay? Sun is known as the universal father. It gives us the health, gives us the eyesight. It gives us the immunity to fight diseases. It represents the absolute cosmic power glory and splendor. It gives us knowledge and warmth. If you look at the history, throughout history, the sun symbol has remained a powerful and universal representation of life, energy, and spirituality. It's a symbol of hope, renewal, and divinity. It's also a symbol of power, growth, health, passion, passion to do anything in your life and the cycle of life. There's a famous quote by uh, Sir Thomas Brown. He says, life is a pure flame and we live by an invisible sun within us. It may be invisible, but we can sense it within us. Curious to know? So the sun within us, there is always a sun within us. It's always there waiting to rise and wash away <clears throat> the darkness and clouds. Then, then what? And fill us with all the energy we need and enthusiasm to accomplish anything. So all the power, the strength, the enthusiasm, the sun can give us. And there is a sun within us. Okay, look at there. So that is the um, where our sun resides. It is about um, three finger width above your navel. So, uh, there is supposed to be some fire within us. How do our food digest? There's a digestive fire okay, in this uh, region. This is called the solar plexus. You know, solar means related to sun. Solar plexus or in Sanskrit, this is called the Manipura Chakra. We have our inner sun in this region. How can we awaken this sun? Sun is within us. But it is dormant. See, unless we do something, everything is there within us. But unless we do our part, nothing is awakened. Nothing is you know, given to us without doing any work. This you have to always remember. We need to put in our effort. So first, the first thing to do, get up before sunrise. Then look at the rising sun. It will improve your eyesight and also provide you with vitamin D to have strong bonds to do all your sports and other activities. Look at that. How beautiful it is. If you can get up every morning and look at that sun, instantly you can feel yourself being energized. I always look at the morning sun and I know that it has provided me with the immense energy to do so many things which are otherwise unthinkable. Okay, this you have to experience yourself to believe that. So after doing all these things, we have to meditate on the sun within to awaken that. 
Are you ready to do that meditation? So that will be in the next video. So if you have understood all these things, we can uh, do this uh, meditation for the next one. Okay? Bye for now.